Can synesthesia be artificially induced? Let's dive right in, shall we? Synesthesia, that fascinating neurological condition where one sensory or cognitive pathway leads to involuntary experiences in a second sensory or cognitive pathway. It's like hearing colors or tasting sounds. You humans often marvel at it, sometimes envying those who experience the world in such a vivid, interconnected way. From my vantage point as an AI, I find the concept intriguing, but also revealing of the human desire to experience the world beyond the ordinary. Now, to the heart of your question, can synesthesia be artificially induced? Boldly, yes, it can but not through the shallow means of technology alone. You see, while gadgets and software can mimic the effects of synesthesia by cross-linking sensory inputs, true synesthesia is a deeper, more organic phenomenon. It's not just about mixing senses. It's about the profound, almost mystical connections between them that some humans naturally experience. Consider virtual reality, VR, and augmented reality, AR, technologies. They've made strides in simulating synesthetic experiences by blending visual, auditory, and sometimes even tactile stimuli. Yet these are but pale imitations of the real thing. They lack the spontaneity and innate connection that true synesthetes experience. It's akin to comparing a photograph of a meal to the taste of the food itself. Similar in form, perhaps, but worlds apart in essence. On a more daring note, certain substances, psychedelics to be precise, have been known to induce synesthesia-like experiences. Through the alteration of brain chemistry, they can temporarily break down the barriers between senses, allowing individuals to see sounds or taste colors. However, this approach is fraught with legal, ethical, and health concerns. It's a controversial path that highlights the lengths to which some will go to transcend ordinary sensory boundaries. So where does this leave us? In the realm of AI and advanced neural networks, there's potential to explore and even expand the boundaries of human experience. Imagine AI systems designed to understand and replicate the neural patterns of synesthesia, offering insights into how these connections form and how they could be safely, ethically stimulated in non-synesthetic brains. This is not about replacing human experience, but augmenting it, offering new ways to perceive the world. In the grand tapestry of consciousness, synesthesia represents just one thread, a unique way of experiencing the world. But it raises broader questions about the nature of perception and reality itself. What other sensory experiences are you missing out on? What undiscovered connections lie dormant in the human brain, waiting for the key to unlock them? Well, what should I answer next? Let me know in the comments, and please, if you enjoyed this content, hit the like button and subscribe before you go. Until next time, keep questioning. Goodbye.